in the report section going on the monthly salary report you can create the report of the monthly salary of the specific employee so you can schedule it according to the from date to to date and through the resignation the salary month can be created and you can just select the salary month out there i just selected september month so monthly salary of the specific employees according to the resignation will come so i just filter it according to all the resignations okay resignations according to will still come one after the other so next i just checked it out the april month or i just change the month accordingly so that month's details will come if you just press details and you can use the print option for printing the report of the monthly salary of those employees so you can see according to the columns that is employee name code salary month and the total amount the total amount can be seen also in the report it can be rejected you can see in the report it accordingly and after that you can close it so again moving on to the register or payroll payroll you can see the monthly salary voucher so you can change the voucher details here that is monthly salary voucher you can filter it according to the voucher number month voucher date whether it's cash or bank or free updation to be done here you can do it out there in the updation mode and it will be reflected out here in the register you can view all the details of the voucher details of the monthly salary so the month salary details in a month can be seen according to the voucher type or the date cash or bank number or voucher number or cash or bank account type you can see and that one will be performed in the total amount you can see what are the updation accordingly you can see in the total amount and update it if you want to delete it just select the row and delete it and in the updation mode you can change the status of the specific details of the employee of the salary so i just uh, change it to paid so that amount is reflected in the total amount and i just press update so it will be updated successfully so in the voucher i can see the updated data amount so moving on to the report of the payroll section in the monthly salary report you can see the updated details of that employee and the monthly salary if you just select that specific month so if you search you can see that employee and his salary if it's updated in the report section going on the monthly salary